Welcome everyone, the first way to fix your sim card not being recognised is I want you to press both the power button and the volume down key together so we're going to press and hold these two down and when you see the slide to power off screen release from the buttons and before we go further I want you to try sliding to power off your iPhone give it 20 seconds and then press and hold the power button to turn it back on Let's see if that works. And after the restart, check if you have these bars here. If you do, great. If you don't, I want you to get the SIM ejector tool for your iPhone. So this should be inside of the box. Uh, this is for my Android phone, the SIM ejector, but it will work. You can use a pin or a paper clip. And we need to locate the SIM card tray. So on my iPhone, it's on the left. And what you're looking for is you have this outline here and then the hole. It may also be on the right. And we're just going to place the thin end of the sim eject tool into the hole. Now we're going to push until we see the lip partially eject. And then you get your nails and take the sim card out. So if I take the sim card out here. This yellow part here, this is the chip, and the phone needs to read the chip. So there could be some dust, it could be a little bit grimy. So you just want to blow. So just blow on this um, bar here. Go right next to it, blow it, and then just rub with your fingers. Okay, so just rub. Just trying to you know, get any dirt or dust or debris off right here. So I'm just going to give it a little rub. There we go. And in the phone as well, there could be some dust blocking the connection. So you're going to blow in the uh, sim area. Let's give that a nice blow. And once we have done this, we're going to insert the sim card back in. So just a reminder, what you're looking for is the ridge of the sim card needs to match the ridge of the SIM card tray. So the ridge is here. So I'm gonna flip my SIM card. And you can see it's gonna go back in. And just make sure everything is flush. And then we're gonna put the SIM card back in. If the tray is not fitting, make sure the hole of the tray is aligned with the hole of the SIM card tray. And then just push this one down and rub it. And I'll see if that one helps. And if this one does, great. Uh, if it does not, we're going to open up the settings. And we're going to head over to the home page of settings. Your SIM card may actually be working, but you may have something in your settings blocking the SIM card. And that is the focus or do not disturb. So tap on either focus or do not disturb. And if any of these are turned on, you will need to turn these ones off. So to check if they're on, if you don't have a home button on your iPhone, slide down from the far right hand side. If you have a home button, swipe up from the bottom. And if you see do not disturb on, or if you see personal on, just turn these ones off. And uh, check if, you know, let's say the phone calls weren't receiving, the messages weren't receiving. See if that helps. If it does not, let's go back to the home page of settings. And then I want you to locate general. And then you're going to scroll to the bottom. And so you see reset or transfer or reset iPhone. And then. You're going to go into the reset here and you're going to reset the network settings. So this will reset you up your SIM cards and uh, hopefully that will solve the problem. If it does not, try and insert another SIM card in this phone that you know works. If that one works, then the SIM card you're trying to insert is faulty and you will need to ask the carrier for a replacement. If your phone does not recognize that other SIM card, your phone is faulty and you'll need to get it into repair. 
With that being said, if you'd like to help support the channel, please do check the description. Bye-bye.